the easy sheet dress. Well, what you don't know is I'm giving up all my secrets today. My grandmother taught my mother and my mother taught me, although it's completely was unnecessary to teach me, but it was the sheath dress because my grandmother was five foot, my mother was five two, and at five nine, I don't really need the sheath. No, <laughs> no I'm kidding. It's our best look. I'm giving you up all the secrets because it was the best way to look your thinnest. It is so classic. It's still the best way to look your thinnest. And we're going to give you some great options today of different ways to do it. And I'm really excited because I think some people are afraid of the sheath dress. I think they think it's too hard. I don't know. But we're going to make it fast, easy, like we always do. We're only going to do four pieces. There's a front, there's a side front, there's a back, and there's a side back. Now, the reason we're only going to do four is we're going to do this sleeveless. This is going to be out of knit, no facings, no linings. Um, so we're using stretch fabrics, but I'm going to give you some fabric options because the coolest thing is, is I don't have to have the whole thing knit. So in this particular case, this is like a, a really cool denim piece. I love this fabric. Um, it's woven. It's a jacquard. It's really beautiful, but I'm only going to do the front out of this. I'm going to do the side out of a stretch denim. So I'm going to give you some fabric ideas because we've got some very cool fabric ideas. This is one that we've got on the site. It's a panel print, it's beautiful. This can be the center. And then of course you can have black Pantaroma on the sides, great, great look. Same with this. It's just this beautiful, great swirl. You position it how you want, put it down the front, put it down the back, and then put a beautiful black Pantaroma on the side. And that is just your best way of looking thin. Women say to me all the time, I've got a wedding, I'm going to a reunion, I'm going to the, the sheath dress, sheath dress, sheath dress. It's always my answer. You have to fit it, but this pattern fits really well. It's just not hard to fit it. It really, truly isn't. I fit it on so many. And I'm going to just talk about really two things you have to watch for because um, commonly I see them go wrong. Number one, I take away the shoulder pad. When I take away the shoulder pad, I have to re-angle the shoulder seam. I don't do that until I cut. I don't even try to do it. I just cut it out, but once it's together, you're going to overlap this and you're going to redraw the angle. You're going to take away an inch there. But again, you really don't have to do it until you put it on, pin out the shoulder seams, re-stitch, and then you're good to go. It doesn't have to be done in the cutting out process. And then you're always going to make it for the bust. Some women say, well, I have really large hips. I don't care. You make it for the bust. You always make it for the bust because that's going to dictate the shoulders, the armholes, and everything else. And then if I need a thicker waist, I can drop it straighter down. So you can make up a muslin. I've made this so many times. You should make up a muslin. That I'm ready to rock and roll. And once you're at that point, you're going to see that it's just really quick, fun sewing. So... We're not going to do any pattern changes. We're simply going to cut this out, sew it up, hit a home run. All right, you're going to join me? All right, so this is the cutting out part. We'll get started. Again, I'm doing a woven in the middle and a knit on the side. Now make sure when you have your denim on the side, obviously that the stretch is going up and down. So that, I mean, so the stretch is going around, obviously. Put your piece up and down so that you get the stretch. I'm going to literally pull this over my head. Because this is a woven, I'm going to leave a little slit in the back, just a little slit. Um, and I'm going to actually make a little facing for it because I'm going to put the center back on a fold and the center front on a fold. And when you do that, be sure you watch your center front lines and your center back lines. Be very careful to make sure it's the right line. It's the center front, not the seam allowance, not anything else. It goes on the fold and then you go from there. And again, really easy. Um, you could, if you don't want to slit in the back, you could leave open a shoulder seam. You could put a little zipper at the shoulder. There's just so many cute little things that you could do to open up the shoulder seam. Maybe I'll put a little zipper in. We'll see. Very simple to do again. On the neck edge, all I'm going to do is surge the neck edge, turn it under, and top stitch. I don't need any facings. I'm going to do the same thing on the armhole. I'm going to do the same thing on the hem. So you're going to see this is just quick, 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 and we're going to have a sheath dress and we'll show it to you all along the way. All right, let's get going.
Here we are, all done. I love my chic dress. It makes me look tall and skinny. Not like my mom and my grandmother, but like my dad's side of the family. So this is the best way. Side panels darker, that's the way to do it. Don't do side panels lighter, that's not gonna work. And then just put on a favorite little cover up. It could be a jacket, it could go formal, it could, you know, I've got different colors so I can switch them out. If I wanna change up the colors or change up where I'm going or make it more, cat, you know, all that kind of stuff. Flats work great, get yourself great little flats. Just don't make it too tight because it doesn't need to be. Give yourself some space. I did end up putting a little zipper rather than the, the slash in the opening. I didn't do that. I, put, I showed you when I was sewing it. I put a little zipper there at the shoulder seam. So it works really good. And I love it. Happy sewing from Silhouette Patterns. <laughs>